Mm. Where did you get all these ones from? Ah, in the bush. Ah, uh -huh. uh, mama. That's so fresh. You work so hard. Like that. Well, no, I don't know why. What can I I don't work hard like this. We starve to death. I have to work. Yeah, okay. Well, you should go and eat your food. Eh? It is inside. And I'm not hungry yet. What I'll do is I'll help you. Let us make enough for the next market day. Let me help you. Okay. You don't know such thing. What you need now is to go inside the house and take a break. Rest very well. After eating, you rest. When you're done with rest, you can come out and give me a helping hand. Come and lend me your hand, you know? Okay? Mama, if you say so. Yes. <laughs> Mama. Mm? Are you okay? Mm. I'm fine. Dust. I swept this place before uh, shelling this uh, pumpkin. Uh, so the dust is too much for me. You know now. Yeah. How it is with dust. Yeah, Mama. Mm. I'll be going to Umaize tomorrow to look for more kind of, they have a lot in the bush. Mm. Yes, ma'am. Are you going with them? Mm, no, I'll be going with just them, my friend. Oh, you people should be careful. Mm. Mm. I'm always too afraid for me. Yeah, yeah, all I have now. You are my eyes, my nose, my husband, Mama, everything. It is well. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Where are you taking her to? I was taking a walk here. I was taking a walk. Says who? Ah, now listen to me. There's only one princess in this kingdom. The senior princess. She alone. You have to follow her back wherever she goes. Do you understand me? Do you want to make myself clear? Yes, no, she won't. Now, you want to make Get out! Come out to your house! If you don't have anything to do, I'll show you what to do. You can never contend for the throne of this kingdom with my daughter. Who told you people I need you to escort me everywhere? But princess, we are only obeying the orders of the queen in which services we've been brought here to do. Tell her I do not need it. Princess, we do not have such boldness to go to the queen and try to change orders. I am the princess. I do whatever I want with my life. I don't want you people around. If you are not jobless, look for Ogonwa. She may accommodate this. I will not. We are following her before the queen gave a counter order that we should attend to you, my princess. Tell the queen I don't need you people attending to me. I want to be left alone. Why is she this way? Why does she always try to make things difficult for us? I know what you will do. I suggest we report this issue to the queen and let her know the difficulties we're facing with the princess. Dede! Eh? Are you alright? Why? You, hey, ordinary maiden, want to go to the queen to report her daughter. Can you want to die? What do you want me to do? Don't you know that princesses are always right? They're always right. So what do we do now? Please, let's follow her. Eh? Follow... That is why the card says that it is good to rub bodies together. Ikenna, we have come a long way, you know. And now we have become like brothers. 
anything that will break this our friendship. May the gods of our land destroy such things. You know, I was already dreaming. Mm -hmm. Dreaming of the day that we save some cow rings and go together in search of wives. <laughs> I'm already saving mine. Yes. I'm already saving from the yam that my father has been giving to me from his yearly harvest. You see? What's the problem? That's where we do. They are only my mother. I can only save from these candles that we will keep from the bushes. Ikena. Life is step by step. The tortoise is slow. But it doesn't stop it from getting to its destination. Okay? I hear you. Let's go before the sun goes to the sky. Did you not see me? Princess, what is the matter? Did you greet me? Oh, my forefather. I did not know you were the one passing Oh, I did not know, honestly. I did not know. It's worse than I thought. How dare you? Open your stupid mouth and say that you saw me, Akajindu, Princess of Omak, who this? walked past me and did not see me. Why did you slap me now, uh, daughter of Igwe Mbata? Why did you slap me? Yes. I teach you a lesson that you will learn the next time you see me, you walk by me. You will see me. Wait, wait, wait. You, 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 you slap me. Oh. Out there. Out there. Out there. Princess. Out there. Out there. Princess. Out there. Princess. Stop hitting me. Princess, what is all this? Princess, what is it? Did you just for the life of me, question me. Ah! I'm sorry, my princess. So you have grown to stand in front of me to question me. Remove your stuff from my face. My daughter, you are a woman and not a man. You must change all these your hard ways. Is this how you're going to go into a man's house and be a housewife and take care of a home? Huh? Look, one, do you really use his temper so easily? False hunters of grievous mishaps. Is that one? Your Highness. She is your daughter. You better take her and go and pull her ears. She must have to change her ways. She, she just must have to change her ways. Otherwise, she won't make it in life. Do you hear me? Go on, my daughter. Your sister Akajindo is not living up to the expectations of someone who will take over this throne if I should pass on. And I'm worried about that. My father, please do not be worried. And I know mean that Akajindo. In a short while, no change. 
change. I'm worried for her. But, but, but listen, Okuma. You are now all I have got. Please don't disappoint me. When I look at you, I see your mother. You are my lovely wife. I see her in you. And that is why I always think about you, I always talk of you. Thank you, my father. I promise I will not disappoint you. But I won't disappoint. I want you to be a wise girl. That is the root to life. Hmm? Thank you, Your Highness. You can go now. Thank you. Forever, Your Highness. What is this thing you are going to do, sir? Come on, Are you a fool? No, no. What do you mean, ma? You are supposed to be a princess. And I expect you to behave and act like one. Why do you want to break my heart? Why? Well, I, I don't know what you're talking about. How can you go about the whole kingdom fighting? What kind of heart do you have? Am I not the princess of Monaco? Is anybody disputing that? Or is it right for anyone in this kingdom to walk by me and not accord me the respect that I deserve as their princess? Depends on the circumstance. This young man walked past me. Don't greet me. Don't talk to me. I called his attention. Do you know what he opened his stupid mouth to say? His big mouth to say that he did not see me. Me. Aka Jindu. He did not see me. And so you had to fight him? No, 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 no. How can I fight him? He brought me up well. Let me beat him up. Truly beat him up. Now tell me, what have you gained by beating up somebody who is supposed to be protected by you, Atihola? What have you gained? I just taught him a lesson how to respect royalty. What do you think is in your father's mind right now concerning this situation? He heard. I wasn't expecting you now. Ha! Ha! Ola! But we agreed that I, I, I was coming today to collect the pencil. You're right. I totally forgot. Honestly. It's just this small one. No? I, the big sum is there. Ready. Mm -hmm. Um, what is the husband of you? Please leave my husband for me. Leave my husband. Come. What is it? Mm -hmm. He said I should start looking for a wife. Eh. <laughs> hey, she's of age. Yes. I Is mean, that strange to you? No, it's not. It's just that I want to tell you my friend. You're my friend. Yes, I am. To start searching with me. You know, I don't go out much again. Oh? So that you look for a girl that is down to earth. Please. Okay. Yeah? That won't be any problem. Eh? Yeah. There are so many good girls in Ubrahma. Hmm. And I'm sure we are going to find a good one for you. Hell, I trust you now. <laughs> Let me run along till tomorrow. Oh, eh? no. eh? When you come to me, you be ready. Okay. okay. Uh, let me keep this basket with you. Uh, so that when you finish, you put them inside the basket. When I come tomorrow, uh -huh. I collect okay, them. Okay, uh, your thoughts are good. Okay. Very, very early in the morning. Okay. To be ready. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Do you remember that song we used to sing? <laughs> I remember what one. Yes. Onye chowa onye onye ya jenso kai kachowa ya mbwa mbwa no ba no sumara gede ayamba jambo sumara gede. Hey, no.
in the house. Ikenna! Where is this boy now? Ikenna! Where is Ikenna? Okay, okay, ma. Uh, I'm here. No, you do. Ikenna. Ikenna is, uh, well, he said that he was going to your house. He said he was coming to my house? Yes. Uh, maybe we have uh, gone different ways. Yes, you must have missed yourselves. Oh, yes. Uh, I'm sure. Okay, now nah. uh, I will rush home so that I will miss him there. Okay. Uh, I want him to accompany me to somewhere, and I, I wanted to show him something too. Yeah. Yes, in there. Okay, my dear. I hope there is no trouble. Oh, no, there's no problem at all. Uh, all is well. Okay. In that case, when you finish with what you're doing, mm. please tell him to come straight home so that his food doesn't get cold. <laughs> Even you, you can be doing it. Ah, there's no problem now. Whatever that belongs to me belongs to him too. I know. Now, let me run along, okay? Oh, well. <laughs> okay, my dear. Bye. Father is not happy with you. I think you should go and talk with him. He is still angry over the thing you did the other day. He's so disappointed. I'm disappointed at everyone. What did I do? I only taught the boy a lesson. Everyone is behaving like I committed some sort of an abomination. What do you think I feel? I can't We are different. We are princesses and women for that matter. There are certain things we're not supposed to do. You are you. Yeah. And I am me. We are sisters, but we are two different people. We're not supposed to behave the same way. All I'm saying is that we are not supposed to bring anger or disappointment to the king was supposed to make him happy. That's the you are teaching me too much. Hmm. No. It's just my opinion. Um, I'm sorry. Are you angry at me? Not yet. If you keep going this way, I will have no option but to be angry with you. Sorry. Are we still going to play in chat? He said we're going to play. Want to be left alone. People with this fly will leave me alone. I want to be left alone. Okay. I'm sorry. Anyway. Are you also disappointed at me? No. no. Please, I want to buy this canal. Please, I want to buy canal. 
Well, nothing more. What do you want to do me here? Hey. I mean, no, 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 no. This, this is what I mean. This is hey. what I mean. I want to buy this. The princess of whom I cried you to. Come, come. I'm going to the stream. To do what? To fish water, of course. Do you know what day it is? I am going to the stream and you're going to the stream. You're still talking! Hey, you're still talking! But the ghost strike you dead! Please, can you just go back to the parents? Why can't you tell me what to do? I'm going to the stream! Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Hey, Kenna, my body is so hot. Let me just remove this cloth so that I can eat this yam very well. <laughs> mm. My friend, you have become an expert in roasting of yams. How? <laughs> This one is well done. If I don't know how to roast yams at my age, what else would I know? <laughs> it is not all about roasting yam. Mm. But it's about roasting it very, very well. I'm happy you're enjoying it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> very well. Mm. I'm enjoying it. Uh, mm. uh, <laughs> <laughs> This your mother's cough is becoming very serious. I don't know. Evil bed. As I'm thinking, my mother. My, my mother. Do you want to disgrace your, your brain to, to, to this house? Huh? Don't you realize who you are? Why do you want to disgrace this throne? The father to defile my order. Defile your order? Who gives orders in this kingdom? You know my lord. Huh? I'm not the princess. You will not shut your mouth. Princess, look, look, look. Please. 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 I'll take you. She's only a child. Our child. Please. Get up, my girl. Get up. Thank you, my husband. Thank you. Ikeme, you cannot continue like this. The death of Unne have only left you a full-grown man. You must realize that you are now all alone. And you must be a man and face life as a man too. Huh? No matter the kind of tears that comes out from your eye, it cannot bring back in there. So all you need to do for me now is to wipe off your tears. Can I ever overcome this? No, mother. No, you can't. I will you not can. forget you. It's only a foolish child that tries to lift his father from the ground. Because any child that tries to lift his father from the ground, his loincloths will cover his face. Are you a fool? No, 
What is the matter with you? You have made your father so angry. Huh. Why do you, by your own volition, want to throw all the good things that the gods have given to you into the bush? Listen to me. If a blind man cannot eat the Udara that is under his feet, then he will never get to eat Udara in his life. Well, I am very sorry. I realize that I have done bad. And I have upset Father, the King. Please. Forgive me. I'm sorry. I need you to come with me to beg the king to ask him to forgive me because I am truly deeply sorry, Mother. I cannot go with you. You have to do that alone. I will not join you to do it. You have to do it by yourself. Eh? Because the head that tears the beehives should be ready to bear the pains that the bees sink. I am not going with you. Father can give her everything and see if I care. Wait. I am the first daughter. Of course I care. That's that's my inheritance. I will not allow anyone to take my position in this palace. Ugonwa! Ugonwa! Please, 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 please
You entered the second bush of Omar. No, I, I thought I was in Umbamo. That is an abomination. I, no, I have strayed into the second bush of Omar. Hey, I'm finished. God! 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 Where are you? God! Come and arrest me! God! God! Yes. Come, 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 Calm down, Kwame. Calm down. That's all you have to say. Calm down. I have told them several. Leave me alone. Stop following me like flies. They won't listen. Tell them to move away from you here. You know they're get away from me. You know they're under instruction from the king to 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 see to our welfare at all times. If you send them away, you will put them in deep trouble. Ugoma, if I need them, I will call for them. I don't. I want to sit here by myself. Tell them to leave me alone. My friend. Leave me alone. My princess, I am sorry. We are not going to leave you because you want to. We are only going to leave you only when we get an instruction from the king. Mm. Other than that, we will keep attending to your needs. Did you hear? Yeah, 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 yeah. You want an instruction from the king? Okay, hey, let's get it. Akadendo. There's a problem in Humak. Elders of Umarak. Your Highness. What is the problem? Your Highness. A stranger has violated the sacred bush of Umarak. Ah. He entered there and I saw him. What? Our own sacred bush? Our own sacred bush. Who by? Your Highness. This stranger from Mbuamon has committed an abomination in Umwako. What have you to say for yourself? Your Highness, we saw him, both of us, Mazigide and myself. We saw him gathering palm fruits from the sacred bush of Umwako. That can be possible. I mean, is he mad? But, uh, uh, are you all right? Uh, huh? Your Majesty. Please, have mercy on me. I was only searching for food. I didn't even know when I entered the sacred bush. I didn't know. I'm from Ugamo. <laughs> the son of Mazio Keke. And Mrs. Umak. Your Majesty, I am alone in the world. No mother, no father, no brother, no sister. <laughs> you are the son of Umak? Yes. From <laughs> Umak. Um, young man, your case will be looked into today. Uh, that! Your Highness. Uh, go and lock him up on the tomorrow when we look into his case. Yes, Your Highness. Yes, Your Let's go. Your Majesty. Yes. There's a prisoner in the palace prison. Prisoner? Yes. The boy in the a boy, a man for that matter. A very handsome man, caught in the sacred bush. Good for him. That will teach others lessons. And then he will be here doing all our hard work. That all the jobs. That man I saw in that prison is not capable of stealing. You saw? Just now? Yes. You already know what he's capable of. Ukonwa, are you falling for a total stranger? Someone you don't know? A thief? You are way too soft, my sister. I can't do it. You're way too soft. Why are you like this? Are you not a woman? Do I look like a man? A woman is supposed to have compassion and sympathy for people who suffer. Miscompulsion. Do whatever you like. It's not my business. 
But do not let the king suspect that you are sympathizing with a thief, someone caught stealing from us. What is wrong with you? But should you condemn a man before you judge him? Hmm? It's not done. You're right. You are absolutely right. Make a good point. Must carry this one. Move it to the palace. Take it to the king and the elders. It is their problem, not mine. Young man, did you not know that no one enters the sacred bush of Omar without the permission of the Eze or the Gwekala? Huh? Your Majesty, I was born and brought up in Mbuamu. I'm a stranger in this land. I do not know the traditions and customs of this land. You broke the law. Ignorance is no excuse. Your Majesty, when I entered the sacred bush, it was not in defiance of the laws of this land. It was a mistake. Well, it, it left me, I, I would let you go since you have said it's a mistake. But then it is better for one person to suffer the wrath of the gods than for the whole kingdom to suffer for the carelessness of one person. Elders of the land, what, what do you say? Elders of Pumak. How can we see the head of the land? and put our digger to the tail. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, so possible. What he has done is an abomination. Mm -hmm. yes. yeah. And then you who commits an abomination must bear it squarely on his head. Mm -hmm. Your shoulders. Right. Our custom states that anyone who enters the second bush of Monaco without the concept of Eze, or you break mm -hmm. the queen's is left immediately. Yes. And he serves mm -hmm. in the king's palace until he dies. Mm -hmm. There are no two ways about to correct. Yes. Correct. Um, Kala, let us hear you. When the gods have decreed, who are we to kill the decrees of the gods? A slave will he become. Yeah, what's the hurry? It's about that man I talked to you about yesterday. What happened? Is he dead? How can you do? How can you wish a man death like that? He's not dead. So what's the hurry if he's not dead? The palace has sentenced him to life of slavery. And that is surprising. He broke the law. He should pay for it. Do you wish to do that for him? It was a mistake, an honest mistake. He didn't just stray into the sacred forest just like that. <laughs> it wasn't intentional. He should have been pardoned. Mm. And you were telling me this because I look like an elder or the king. Right? Can you not have pity for your fellow human being? For once in your life, just once. <laughs> I was here minding my business. I was meditating. Yes, to go on. I was. I don't have time for this. Do what you like with him. But trust me, if my mother or the king even suspect you have anything to do with him, you will be banished from this kingdom. <laughs> Better for me too. Vanish, vanish, vanish. Have it at the back of your mind.
don't you rest? I'm talking to you. Why are you ignoring me? Princess. Why do you want to put yourself in great danger? Don't you know that loyalty does not mix with slavery? Mother, there's a portion of work I must complete each day, without which I will receive punishment from the king's guards. I am a princess, and I can tell you to stop work and rest a little. Princess, your orders did not banish me to slavery. It was the king's orders. So your orders can never change the king's orders. What did you do? Don't bring it to my remembrance. The misfortune that brought me to this. You know, they say that if your legs do not walk you into trouble, your clothes will certainly do. Can I get you some water to drink? Princess, you're putting me into serious trouble. You are a princess. I am a slave. What a court do we have? I'm sorry. I thought I was going to lessen your burden a bit. I brought you some uh, roasted yam and uh, water. Ezema, thank you. But Ezema, you put me in real trouble. How? I'm being watched. Hey. And if I'm found with you, I'll pay heavily for it. Hey. Ezema, it's going, it's going. Hide, hide, hide. After we'll take off. You've wasted much time on this trip. Huh? Or don't you know you have more of this you take home today? Huh? Sorry. Sorry. Huh? And I'll move it. Or do you want me to go to the king and tell him to increase your level? No, I'm not sure. Then move it, lazy man. that you should have nothing to do with that slave boy in this palace. You understand? <clears throat> I don't want to sleep over normal people. No lie. The princess of Omar could have to do with his slave. <laughs> uh, mother, was he born a slave? That's a very stupid question. Born a slave, made a slave. It's the same thing. A slave is a slave. Mother has said you shouldn't have anything to do. No, no, no. It was not mother that said it all. The custom and tradition of this woman said it. And if you know what is good for you, don't make the king angry. Otherwise, he will put you to shame and banish you from this from this woman. 
Can you just leave so I can have a talk with my daughter, the princess? Hmm? Yeah. Thank you. See, I'll wait for you here. Don't waste my time like before. If you fail, Some food and water. Is a man. Huh? Very good for me. Okay. I want you to always be very careful around here. I don't want them to know that you have seen me. Okay, now. You are a very good friend. And I promise you always that I will always be by your side. So, quickly eat this food before the guy starts looking for you. Huh? for today. We have to feed you before we retire for our day, my princess. Daddy. My princess. Do you like your job as the head of the maiden in this palace? Yes, I do, my princess. Have I done anything to offend you, my princess? You're heading there. And then something will happen to that your job. Am I not the one in need of your services? Yes, you are. Why then do you argue with me if I say I don't need it? That I want to be left alone? I'm sorry, my princess. I'm just being zealous about the work I was asked to do in the palace. I'm sorry. I let that zoo burn you like a rat. My princess, please. Please forgive her. And don't put her into trouble. We're only doing as we ordered. I promise to be more careful from now on, my princess. You can leave. Thank you, my princess. Thank you. What do you want? The sun that shines for the kingdom. The daughter of our great king. 
I know who I am. What do you want? I can admit you to my position as a slave in this palace to ask you whether you want a slave to do anything for you. That's what my men said there for. If I want anything, I will ask them to do it. I do not need the services of a slave boy. Princess, this world is a cycle. I was not born a slave. I was made a slave. Indeed a bold one. But you will get into trouble. If I mention this conversation to my father, the king. Master, for granting me freedom. Who is your master? What are you? What are you doing in that pot? I am the genie that watches over your ancestor. I was locked up in that pot as a prisoner. And there was war between Umweze and Umwaka thousands of years ago. Thank you for granting me freedom. What is your name? I am Gridim. I know your name. I know your story. What would you have me do for you, Master? The slave boy. Uh, what was it I wanted to Princess. Princess. You look worried. I mean, why are you looking so sad and upset? Is that slave boy, father? The slave boy? Yes. What has he done to you? His boldness is very irritating. Boldness? How? Father, he sneaked up on me and had the cause to address me. The slave? Yes. Sneaked up on the princess? Has she has, has he gone mad? Dad! Yes, I Go and flog that slave boy thoroughly. You get me? Yes, sir. Give him a thorough beating. Yes, sir. Yes. My princess, are you now satisfied? Yes, father. By the time they finish with him, he will never have the guts to even greet you, not to talk of addressing you. Thank you, Father.
see more pains. Huh? He is a slave, is he not? He was not born a slave, Akajindu. Our tradition made him a slave. Born a slave? Tradition made him a slave? It does not matter to me. It's all the same. A slave is a slave. What's your point? Akajindu. The only difference is that you have royalty running through your veins. He is a human being just like you. Is this the point where you make me feel bad for treating a slave as a slave? All I'm saying is that you should not use your privileged position to oppress the less privileged. Go. Okay, I hear you. Defender of the less privileged. You're done. Walk away. Go away from my sight before you upset me because you're heading there. I catch you. Life is in phases. You're still here. Go away from here. Do I look like I'm joking to you? <sighs> you, you will soon tell me your, your, your business with that boy. I I I I Custodian of the dead. It is you who live between the living and the dead. You have the eyes of the cat and the claws of the tiger. We do and I do. Welcome to the palace. Oh, you are. I don't know anything about you. We do not know what you are going to do. You are going to do. King of the great kingdom of Sumaco. I greet you. You are welcome. So, why are you here? I have come to talk about the one. That is to take over from you. The one that is to take over from me. I have two daughters. Your Highness, must proverbs be explained to you when they are said? Are you not the custodian of the culture and traditions of the people? You see, the, the thing is that. Your well, choice of words, uh, parables, in fact, uh, put some confusion into me that some of your wise sayings get lost. Does the one that opens the womb ceases to be the first inheritance? Uh, that is true where there is no male child. Eyes of the God. The first daughter has been marked strongly by the gods. She is a woman with the heart of a man. She is a man in the body of a woman. Well, in, in that case, uh, it is all very well. Uh, you see, the, 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 it's better for the heart of a man to dwell in the body of a woman than where there is no man at all. Is her greatest undoing. Her strong heart will put her in serious troubles with the gods. And she will suffer a lot of pains getting purified. Well, uh, your message is heartbreaking but very revealing. You have now announced the coming of the storm. And then you will pave the way for the prevention of calamities that come with the storm. So, what do we do? The gods have given warning, but they have not shown us 
how to stop the calamity. I will go in with them and ask questions. Whatever they say to me, you will hear. Alright, do that, Igokala, do that. And uh, I'll show you that whatever it will take to get to the bottom of this, I will be equal to the task. Thank you very much. Your Highness, you are the servant of the gods. I'm sure, very sure, that the gods will not let you be sorrowful. Thank you, Goka. <laughs> Princess, why? Why do you want to make a life more miserable in this palace? Why? Why? Akina. Akina, I heard your cry. It's so sorrowful and painful. I've come to soothe your pains. I bought some herbs. For you to use on your wounds. Princess, you're taking a great risk. And you're putting my life in great danger. Look, I am a slave. And I'm destined for a life of faith and bitterness. Oh. Okay, now. You are not a slave. You were not born a slave. I believe that someday the gods will have pity on you and set you free from here. Yes. In death, I know I'll be free forever. Because a dead man will no more no pains and bitterness. I heard you've not been eating your food. If you do not eat, how else will you have strength to bear the pains? Princess, please leave me alone. Please. <laughs> you know. I will leave you. I will leave you. But what I want you to know is hope never dies. When next they bring your food, please eat it. My worries about Akajin the worse. How? What did you say about my daughter? What the gods said he related. My dear husband, why are you keeping me in such suspense? It's my daughter. Let me hear it. 
the chief priest said that the God said that our daughter Kajinli will suffer much in their hands because of her strong heart. Think about uh, the chief priest. What does he intend to do about this calamity? He has gone back to his cover to seek the faces of the gods and has promised to come back if he gets an answer from them. Oh. Oh. So, why are we waiting for the answer? What are we going to do? What do you want us to do? You want us to fault the gods? Eh? Hmm. You just go and talk to your daughter about her strong heart. Maybe if she changes, then uh, those things that the gods have decreed will not come uh, upon her. Huh? Talk to her. I have heard you, my husband. I will do my best. Better do your best. I can see you are no longer afraid of the king. Oops. You will cheat if I committed it. You don't know we're not supposed to associate his slaves in this palace. There's nothing wrong with showing pity and mercy for those who are suffering, those in pain. Absolutely nothing. As long as they are not slaves. It's an abomination. Akajindu, this one was not born a slave. He only made a mistake. Who, which any other person could have done. Why are you being headstrong over this? I don't know why you're talking like this. I only said I showed mercy. That's all. I have seen where that mercy is leading you to. It's going to get you into trouble. Are you going to tell the father? I don't know. There's no telling what I can say in the presence of the king. Please. And you know the consequences of disobeying his majesty. Kajindu, please, I'm begging you, do not let the king hear about this. Okay, I promise. I would have nothing to do with him anymore. The slave? Yes. Please. Princess of Mercy. I will. Thank you. Put my eyes are on you. Your normal duty starts tomorrow. Your rest is over. And we heard that you have not been eating your meals. Well, you better start eating now because your labor is going to be harder. Princess of You're majestic and beautiful like the rainbow. I say you're not afraid. Dead men do not fear. I am a dead man and I can no longer feel the needs. You are courageous. Courage lives in the heart. We are all mortals. And no one has his life in his hands. We all have it tomorrow. And no one knows what his tomorrow will bring. We may know of today. But our tomorrow is in the hands of the gods. And what they like, they present. Spoken like a true warrior. Your pain, it's your war. Deal with it, slave. You need just to my mother. Go. Yes, ma. I hear you are frolicking. Romancing. With a slave in this palace. My forefathers. Why your forefathers? 
you want to know the consequences of one who does a thing like that in this palace? I'm Juno. So, why did you decide to rebel against this royal throne of Omako, the king? Hunter, please have mercy. Please. I was only showing mercy. That's, that's so. Who's one? Would you want the king to hear it? Or would you want me to treat it my own way? Mother, please. Please, don't, don't let the king hear about this. He will banish me from the palace. Please, I beg you. Then, you have to serve as a slave in this palace for one week. You have to fetch water from Iyakasa. All alone. Mother, Iyakasa is a very dangerous and lonely place to go to. All alone, please. I... I... So... You want the king to hear this? No. Uh, I, I, will, I will go. I will fetch. Good. When the sun is high in the sky, you have to take a pot. The king's favorite drinking pot from this palace. And fetch water from Yagaza twice every day for five solid days all alone now get out get out of my sight yes you are just my princess your food is ready now I'm hungry has anybody served my princess before now I am not hungry. Is my princess okay? Shall I call the doctor? <sighs> Why are you so stubborn? Stop torturing me with your stubbornness, please. I am not hungry. I'm sorry, my princess. I'm just being concerned about your welfare. I'm sorry. I am fine. I am not sick. I am not hungry. If I were, I know where the food is. I will go take it. My princess, you know there is a pattern to everything that happens here in the palace. And the king has passed an order that nobody should go against these rules. Not even any member of the royal family must go against this rule. And you know there is a time to sleep, a time to wake up and a time to wash our faces in the palace. And this is actually time to have our meals. Please, you have to go with me. Stop touching me. What's your time? Go. Oh, I'm right behind you. I'm sorry, my princess. I can't leave here without you. You are so annoying. I'm sorry, my princess. father is going to be with his fathers, he will solely rule this kingdom. <laughs> but more than whoever steps into father's shoes will be who he appoints. What if my person is my stepsister? Your stepsister? No. Why will she be to contend with you? Why will she be to struggle for the throne with you? 
Well, she's right here in the palace. It's not as if she's dead. Don't be bothered about her. She's as good as dead. <laughs> but why are you speaking this way? I will not live to see any of you struggling over the throne of Umar with you. If I speak to you now, she sent her way to Iyagaza. <laughs> Iyagaza? Yes. Oh, yeah. By this time of the day, she will be she will be a great danger. Dear, you see, you see why I said you shouldn't bother yourself about her? Because nobody goes to India Gaza and comes back alive. <laughs> you know, you're a genius. Yes. You and I will rule in this kingdom. We'll be in this entire palace all alone. With all the meanings. Strumming to please us just as we desire. <laughs> Thank you, my mother, for thinking good thoughts for me. That is why I am your mother. Wait, wait, wait. Put it down. It's too heavy. Where do you live? Let me take it home for you. Hey, my dear, you can't get to my home. I live in a very far place. I'll take it home by myself. Meanwhile, how did you come to this place all alone? Don't you know that this place is very dangerous for one to come alone? Don't you know? Mama, I didn't just come here by myself. My stepmother sent me here to fetch the water as punishment for helping me sleep. I see. And I must come back with the pot filled with agas and water, or face being reported to the king, my father, mm. for helping me sleep in pains. Okay, my daughter, you have a very pure and clean heart. A man with pure and clean heart can never meet any danger on his way. But let me tell you something. You go to Iyagaza and come back in peace. But let me warn you again. While on your way, Make sure you are very, very careful. You are here all alone. Mm -hmm. okay. Can you help me? Can you help good, me? Be a good girl. Thank you. Mm -hmm. My daughter, you are great. Okay. Like I told you, be very careful. Yeah? Yes. Bye bye. Be careful too. My children. 
Yes. Yes. Mm. I'm a daughter of God. My first son has sons today. Is there anything about her? Are you sure that? Yes, my lord. She's well. Mm. She went out with her maidens to see the village. And sometimes they, they get bored to stay around the palace looking around. And I command them to go out and see the village. Mm -hmm. To kill your brother. <laughs> that's very good of you. You're a good woman. Thank you. Yeah, that's, good. that's good, that's good. Thank you, my lord. Oh, yeah, that's all I wanted to find out for you. It's huh? okay, my lord. Thank you, my lord. You live forever. <laughs> about Goma. Shh. What about? Why are you worried about her? She's my sister. My only sister. I truly don't want any bad to be for her. Now I know that you have foolish, stupid girl. Shut that as long as she's in this palace, they will not move forward for you. No progress. Your father's heart has gone out for her. Can't you see? But what would I stand to gain if she was to leave the way for me? The throne! Can't you understand? You gave me throne! Mother, since you spoke to me about her, I have really had no peace of mind. I just want to plead with you, please. I really don't want anything bad to happen to go. But she broke the law. She broke the law. Yeah, yeah, you, you know, the, uh, it is not permitted for anybody to, to fake with all these slaves. Yes. Don't know what she was doing, mother. She, she really went to help with the room. He had me on his bed and she went to help him. But that is still breaking the law. Listen, I was only being merciful by sending her to here, Gaza. Your father, the king, would have banished her from his kingdom. Is it not better to be banished than to be sent out to you as to face those spirits who remain around there? Anyway, it is too late. She's already in the year. <laughs> Stop 
crying. <laughs> Clean your eyes. Nobody will kill you. I will help you out. The only help I need now is for another pot for my pot to be replaced. This pot is not supposed to leave the king's palace, but my stepmother made me bring it to this tree. <laughs> my daughter, they say one good turn deserves another. When I was struggling with my load, you helped me out. You even said you wanted to take my load to my house, but I refused. Now you are in distress. I will help you out. Hmm? How are you going to help me? Are you going to follow me to the palace? Mm -hmm. They won't even listen to me. It won't make the matter worse. Maybe I should just run away and never go back to the palace again. That is what they want. <laughs> And you will not run away. You will not run away. That is what they want. Now you said all you want is a port. I will help you. Mama. All these are for you. Take the clothes and the carries and go home. What about the pot? I'll send it. It will get there before you get home. Filled with water. I said, go home. Pick them. Go home. It is I, Goma. Goma. Where are you from? I'm from the stream. Stream? Where did the ask you to go and fetch for me? It, it is at its place. Where did you get all this in from? It was from an old woman who helped me. An old woman? Mama. Yes, Your Majesty. Did you get to see someone's dress? No, I did not. I, I, I didn't steal. It was an old woman that gave me all of these. On my way to the stream, I saw her and helped her. And... Um, when I fetched the water, I slipped and fell and broke my pot. The, the woman came and replaced my pot and gave me all of these. She even gave me these clothes I'm wearing. So you have also added lies to your bad behaviors. Your Majesty, I'm not lying. I'm telling you the truth. Give me those dresses. Give me those dresses! Give me Can you go in there and remove these dresses and bring them back to me? Go now! Get out! Yes, Your Majesty. Run! Your heart is bitter and unforgiving. 
that a man must learn how to forgive in order to make his life sweet. I've suffered. I've lived in poverty all my life. I've suffered. For a man to go forward, he must forget the past and think about the future. Because thinking about the past can only bring pains and regrets to you. Therefore, the present is better than the past and shorter than the future. Master, what do you want from me? I'm very confused now. I cannot tell you I'm sure of what I want to ask from you now. Then you have to be sure of what you want and then ask me. But where will I even see you when I now make up my mind about what I will do? Just call my name Gridin and I will come to your service. <laughs> he can son of a lot. There's nothing I will not see you. If I just call his name. He will appear. Just like that. Master. Master. Mm -hmm. It is this turn. It is time. Good deal. Master, what do you want from me? Oh, from you. I, I forgot. I, I, okay. Okay, hey, good deal. Why do you always appear with different faces? Master, I am a spirit and I can appear in any form. This is true. Okay, I just called him Kriti. Master! I what do you want from me again? Oh, I, I, this one is now. I, I, I was talking to myself. Hey! This is true. This is true. I just call you Gideon. Oh, please, I'm not giving me a lot of See how I was sitting with this girl. We're just sitting comfortably here in this palace. And the case is. Gradually and systematically overtaking you. Look at all this. Look at it. all these expensive dresses and bag of money. They belong to your sister. Oh. I sent her to Yagaza to go and meet with the spirits. She went there and found favor in their eyes. Brought all these gifts. Money. And the, the trunk. I don't know how this is my business. You don't know? No. You must get ready and go to that Asia Gaza and meet with that old man on, on the way to E. No? Yes, now. What do you mean, what? The problem I have with you is that you are too strong headed, strong willed. Your mother, I will never ask you to do anything that will land you into trouble. But you really mean that go there and they kill me instead of giving me gifts? They will not kill you. You don't have my spirits here. They will not kill you. Did they kill her? If they will not kill her, then they will not kill you. Listen to me. We are going to meet with that old man to get your own gifts. And listen to me. When you get there, let her know that we are the real princess and not the gold man. Oh, well, I'm not going to the street. Tomorrow afternoon. <sighs> Mother, I'm not really comfortable with this, your plan. Hey, let's go. 
We are so chicken hearted. As soon as I told the woman that she would go, she quickly ran to the place. Without fear, I look at you here, battling and dangling between two opinions. Don't you like all these expensive this this is and back of carry for yourself? Oh no, sorry, we will be looking at the show. Fight on! Go! Are you still sitting now? Is that not uh, in the presence of Umaka? Uh -huh. That is she. So where is she going alone without a port? White mouth. Then I won't reach there. Use your white mouth and ask her. Princess, we greet you. Princess, we greet you. Princess, we are greeting you. What is it? Is there a law that states a must answer to your greetings? My princess, we want to know why you're going about without your maidens. Are you mad? Is something wrong with that big head of yours? How is that your business? Will you remove your silly selves from my sight before I call or unleash my father's guts on you people? Look at you. Princess, please, I'm sorry for putting you Huh? Come. Are you sure this is daughter of Igwe Mbata? Are you blind? Hmm? Or are you a stranger in this village? Who does not know how sharp and bad her mouth is? Hmm? Did I not tell you? Did I not tell you? Everybody in this village knows how bad uh, her, her manner is. Eh? Yeah? Please let's go before she, she, she sends the guys to come and beat us. Let's go. Mother, where are you? Why have you left me here to suffer all by myself? Death. Oh, death. Look at what you've done to me. I'm a slave in my father's house. Who will console me? Princess! Is this where you are? The king wants you. Are you okay? I'm okay. I can't see the king like this. Well, he said I should come with you. Tell him I will see him some other time. But what if he finds out that nothing is wrong with you? What do I say to him? Tell him I'm in my period. Okay. Let me do as you say. Princess. Where is this old woman? She has to come see me. Hey, woman! Didn't you see me? So? Hey! So? Your mother did not teach you how to greet an elderly person when you see them. Elders, you don't look like one to me. I am here to see an old woman and I don't see her around. Do you even know who you are talking to? Who are you? I am Akajito, the first daughter of King Mbata of Umago. So you do know who you are addressing now, right? Not just a villager passing by. You. <laughs> a stubborn fly that must rest in the corpse in the grave. So, because your father is a king, eh? That is why you are so stubborn and foolish. I see you are one of those who don't know how to address their princess. This is how you address the princess of this kingdom? Let me be done with what I'm doing. I will send my guards. They will certainly find you 
and they will teach you how to dress hey. a princess. A stubborn fly that must rest in the belly of Oko the bed. I have no business with you. Okay. A man who leaves an experiment on his own pension with a body of noisy flies. Princess, you don't have business with Don't worry, you will still look for me. I do not have any business with you. Leave me alone. Mind your own business. Good. What nonsense? I said she knows what I would do with her when I'm done with this silly old woman. And now where is she? Suffering continue. Oh, our forefathers, how long will you allow this kind of wickedness to continue? What will I do? My master, what does my master want from me? Greeting. I am very bitter. I want you to free me from all this suffering. It's too much. Remember what I told you about forgiveness. I cannot walk in an atmosphere of bitterness. Hmm. I understand. I forgive all my enemies. You are hungry. Very hungry. How did you know that? I am a spirit. I see beyond the ordinary. Meaning that you can give me food? But you must ask for it. Greeting. I am hungry. Give me food. Here is the food. Eat and regain your strength. The meaning of this. Where is this place? You are far from home. I told you they are waiting for me at the palace. Where is where is the gifts? The, the gifts, the stuff you gave to my sister. Where's my? You still need your own gift? Yes. Okay. Follow me.
your highness. Your highness. Baby. Yes, your highness. The princess, my daughter. Yes. Ever since Princess Akadintu instructed us not to follow her after our morning duties with her, we stopped. Except when she's leaving the palace, that's why we go out with her. No, she will. No, she should be in her room at the resting place. No. Your Highness. I'm going to tell her to come and see me now. But if you should stay back and wait for her to return. She's not in her resting place. She's not here. Huh? Who did she have gone to? God help me. Who is this place? Where are we now? I think you need to rest first. You are tired. So I want you to rest. I'll give you food to eat. Oh, dear. Is this a joke? What is this? Don't you have anything fit for a princess to eat? This is what we eat here. Boiled corn, pancano. Stop! Stop! I can see. This is not what a princess eats. I eat bush meat, fresh palm drink. This is rotten. I need something fit for a princess to eat. Eat what is being placed before you and stop complaining. You are not looking so bright. What is the matter? It's my daughter, my king. What about Akajima? She's missing. What? Missing? How? <laughs> we have not seen her since afternoon of yesterday. Oh. I, I thought she was in, she has retired as it is with her. But when we asked her neighbors, they said they too thought she was in her room. And just the way I thought. And so? They went to her room and she wasn't there. So where is she now? I will love you, my lord. You see what I tell you about Akajundu, you see? I told you that one day this girl will do something to harm herself. Ah, 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 look at it now. What are we going to do now? Huh? Where are the ladies? I send them all out to go and start searching for her. Uh, they had better find her out. Because if anything happens to that girl, if she did anything happen to Akajundu, Wait. Uh, Why have you? Give me what I want to eat. This tasteless food. Are you the one I'm talking to? Okay. You won't give me. I'll go back to my father's palace. Welcome to Greenland. Oh, good day. Where on earth are we going to go and look for the princess now? Eh? 
We've searched everywhere in Umako village and no one seems to have seen any trace of her. What kind of problem is this? Do you know whether she has run away with the man in this neighborhood? Oh my god! ADD! Eh? Did you hear what you just said with this your mouth? I pray this your mouth will not land you into trouble. What kind of thing is that? But come to think of it, which man in this village do you think Aka Jindu will be able to mingle herself with? Hmm? Eh? Oh. Have you forgotten what her kind of person? Eh? Tell me, if she has not, where, 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 where has she gone to? Where? Tell Only us! the girls will be able to answer that question. See how she has kept the whole palace on their toes. We better return to the palace and tell the queen that we are not able to find her daughter. Simple. I that's it. So yeah, I'm tired. So. This girl is so stubborn. She's so, so stubborn. Every time she'll be like, baby. Something like, 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 like this. of our land. I didn't hear a word that you said. Now tell me, why then are you here? Why are you terminating the whole compound when others are out there searching for your missing sister? What are you doing here? Because I didn't know they were searching for my sister. Oh, how would you know? We are busy romancing and frolicking with your slave boy. Mother, it's not like that. Oh, will you shut up? Shut up your mouth. Let me go and join others in search of your missing sister. Run! Get out! My master! Greetings. Did I call you? I know you are tired and you need to be strengthened. That's why I've brought this food and water. Thank you for the food and water. But what I want now is to be freed from slavery. If I do what you want, you will be free from slavery. But you can never get out of poverty. I will lead you to the path of freedom that is total and complete. Who will that be? Hmm. The road to your freedom is too narrow and filled with blocks of sorrows. But don't worry, at last you must get your freedom. And not only getting your freedom, you will give freedom to others. Hmm. Help me now. I'm reaching a breaking point. If you don't do something now, I may give up and die. Master, eat your food because I know the journey you're about to make. There are lots of prizes to be paid. Have I not paid enough price?
to go home. Where is home? You are in the land of the dead. The land of no return. What have I done to myself? Greed is the greatest enemy. It has two heads. My mother has killed me. I don't have listened to her. Too late. Too late. <laughs> Your Majesty. Before you, I, the son of Oluako, am nothing. My life is in your hands. Um, get on your knees. What do you know about my daughter, the princess? Your Majesty. I don't know anything about the princess. Liar! Liar! Slitter liar! Be patient. Be patient, my wife. Oh, my highness, he's lying. He's lying. You're not taking this matter seriously. This boy is lying. Let me get something out of him. Let me question him further. Young man. Your Majesty. Mm -hmm. Since I was flogged for going to greet the princess, I've never gone close to her. Let alone walking in her ways. I have never. You've never been close to her, eh? eh? You insist on telling lies. Eh? So why don't you tell us the truth? Why don't you tell us the truth? But! Your Highness, take him to the stake. Flog him until he tells us the truth. Your Highness. Your Highness. Has he confessed? Your Highness, he's still holding on to his deniers. Did you flog him well? We gave him 39 strokes of the cane. And he didn't own up? No, Your Highness. Hmm. That boy must be innocent. <laughs> this life. You have to give him 39 lashes. Huh? Huh? Your, Your Highness, that will make him talk. Uh -huh. That will make him talk. And did, did he talk? No. Huh? You all get out of me. Get, get away from me. All of you. All, the, all you guards. Go away. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Don't frown like this. I am also worried about Akajind. Ever since she got missing from the palace, I have never had a good sleep. Hmm? The slave himself denies any complicity in her disappearance. Oh, this slave that has been pestering my daughter a 
I'm still denying him. I'm saying he does not know anything about my daughter. You believe him. Oh. Ah. I will summon the elders. I think that's what I will do. I will summon the elders and then we will put hands together and summon some strong men to and send them out as a search party <laughs> for Akajendo. Aha! Uh -huh. And the. Uh, uh, Ugokala. I have to talk to him too. What does he know? What do you know? What does he know? He is the custodian of the gods of Omaku. There may be something he knows that we do not know. Uh, and then uh, I want him to tell me something that I, 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 I mean, Your that's something highness, I don't know. Your Highness, my husband, if you ask me, I will say that going to see Igwekala is a waste of time. About, uh, discussing with them to select uh, everybody men to go last search party. No one is okay. Uh, yes. Okay. Uh, Master, what do you want from me? You said you were going to set me free from all this. You are on your way to freedom. Like this? Yes. No thorns, no crowns. To be pure and valued, the gold must pass through fire. So you must have to enjoy the present hardship so that you will see the glorious end. Good deal. What you're saying is too hard for me to understand. Master, I can hear the footsteps of nursing hands. So see you later. Kima. I heard your voice when I was coming. Were you speaking with anyone? Why do you break the laws of this palace? I'm mingling with a slave. You don't expect me to keep quiet when I hear the cry of distress. I you can't. Princess, you jeopardize your life. Whatever comes out of this, I will take the heat. I bought this one so that you have some strength.
greet him. Master. Why are you here? I did not summon you. I have come to give you strength and to warn you of the things to come. Anytime you need me, I will still come. My wife, the queen, suggested we send the slave boy. Yes. If he goes there and dies there, well, that will be his luck. But if he comes back successful, mm -hmm. and that will be our luck. into the land of the dead are still here and planning more evil. I understand your grief. But please do not let your heart be troubled so much for help shall come. Ibukala, have I not had enough of proverbs and parables? Huh? The ears of an elder must hear, and the heart understand proverbs and parables. The matter is that the youths have refused to go in search of my daughter in the land of the dead. So what do we do? Sacrifices. Let us offer the gods some colour and blood. The gods give blood. We eat meat. Let us fill their hearts with blood, and maybe solution will come from them. All right, I've heard you. So I shall do as you have said. But while you are at it, talk to them about me. Let them have mercy on me and my household. Huh? The head that arouses the beehive tells the story of the stings. Your daughter got in the ways of the bees, and now she is bearing the pains of this thing. That old woman keeps bringing me back. If you try and fail, you rise and try again. <laughs> 